hi there in this tutorial video i am going to show you how to upload all the lab manual pages onto canvas all lab manual pages and activities are to be submitted onto canvas you will not be submitting the lab book until the end of the semester so to get started here we are as you can see i am on the home page for the com 111 class and i am in the student view so this should be somewhat similar to what you see in your Canvas, Canvas shell. So what you want to do is when you're ready to upload your lab manual pages onto Canvas, you want to scroll all the way down to the, to the module titled Lab. So I'm going to show you how to submit the lab manual pages onto Canvas. So first, you want to find the appropriate lab assignment you want to submit. For example, here is the first lab assignment you will submit. It is titled Lab. Let's get acquainted to it. Page 2. So you want to click on the assignment itself. And it's going to take you right here to the assignment page. And as you can see, it says Lab. Let's get acquainted to it. Page 2. Welcome to the Ohlone College Communication Lab. Please make sure you complete the required pages and have the tutor Sign off on this work. Lab requirements. Remember to punch in on, on the lab sign-in sheet and sign in on, onto the computer using your Ohlone student ID. Don't forget, a tutor or instructor must sign your hours for them to count. If your sign-in sheet does not have the tutor signature, your hours that you were in the lab will not count. So make sure you get the tutor or instructor to sign the lab sheets for credit. Next, we're going to talk about the submission requirements. So for every page that you complete in the lab manual, you want to make sure that you get a tutor or instructor to sign the, sign the bottom of the, sh the page that you have just completed. And after they have signed the page that you just completed, you want to make sure that you clearly Print your name in pen under the instructor slash tutor signature line. This is to prove that the assignment you are submitting is in fact from your lab manual. Secondly, you want to take a picture or a scan of the page or pages requested. Remember, the pages that you, you are submitting must show all four corners. If you do not have a signature, you will not get credit for the assignment. Additionally, if you are submitting more than one page for the submission, which you will have to do for certain lab activities, you must submit all pages onto a, word, a single document, which could be either a Word document, a PDF document, or a Google document. And I'm going to show you how to do that right now in this tutorial video. So as you can see here, I have a picture taken of a lab manual page, page two, and it shows all four corners or most of it. Now, what you want to do is open up a Word document, which is what I'm doing now. You want to start a blank document and you have a blank Word document here. Next, you want to go to insert, which is right here on the corner. Click on insert. And then you want to click on pictures. And then you want to locate the picture that you are submitting. In this case, I'm going to scroll down and find the picture that I want to submit. And in this case, it's page two. And as you can see, this is page two. It is clearly pasted onto the Word document. Now, when you want to submit an, when you want to submit another page, you want to hit enter, enter again. It will open up a, another Word document, the second Word page. You want to click insert again. And then you want to click on pictures again. And then you want to select on the next lab manual activity you want to submit, which in this case is page four. And then if you need to submit another photograph, or picture, you want to hit enter again, another enter, 
Then you want to do the same thing and go back to insert. Click on insert and then click on pictures. And then you want to click on the folder you want to submit. And in this case, it was page five. And as you can see, scroll back all the way up. You have page two, you have page four, and you have page five. And this is all in one document. So this is what I mean. When all when you submit a lab manual pages onto Canvas, it has to be into one document when submitting multiple pages. So this is what I mean. Okay, you have all three pictures on one single document. Next, you want to hit File, and then you want to hit Save As, and then you want to select where you want to save it, and then you want to hit up, and then you want to save it. So you want to choose the name you want to save it as. In this, in this case, I'm going to save it as Lab Page 2 Submission. After that, you want to hit Enter, and it is saved as Lab Page Submission. And then, you want to go back to the assignment that you are submitting it to. In this case, it is Lab Let's Get a Crane Tour Page 2. You want to click on Submit Assignment. And then you want to hit choose file. So then you want to locate the file that you just created, which in my case was lab page submission. You want to select open. And the assignment is there. Once you figure that out, that the assignment is there, you want to click submit assignment. And then you want to wait a bit for it to officially submit your assignment. Could take a while. And then, once it's submitted, it'll look like this. Your page will look like this. It'll say, submitted October 17th at 1.3 a.m. You can view submission details, which I encourage you to do. So click on view submission details. You want to click on view feedback. And it'll open up so you can preview what you just submitted. So open it all the way up. And as you can see, I have submitted the lab assignment with all three pages. This is page two, this is page four, and this is page five. Submitted all in one document. This is crucial when you're submitting lab assignments. All lab assignments need to be submitted on one single document for credit. You should not be submitting multiple documents. I have just shown you how to submit everything onto one document. I hope this video was helpful in submitting your lab assignments. If you are still confused on how to submit the lab assignments, please feel free to reach out to me via Canvas, and I can further address how to submit the lab assignments for this class. Thank you so much for watching.